Leong Leong um, was commissioned by a storefront um, for an architecture to design the exhibition or the experience of the U.S. Pavilion. Um, I think the ambition of the project was to generally try to understand um, modernism in relationship to architectural office, both from um, a perspective that's about the production of architecture, but also um, the role of history within the process of design. So we were asked to design an environment that addressed this, this broad issue, and over the course of many conversations and um, kind of collaborative discussions, um, the project was boiled down into two main components, which were the repository and the kind of immense um, history of modernist architecture, um, sort of researched by the curators, and then an architectural office, which was conceived of as a kind of petri dish or prototype for a new um, kind of mode of architectural production. Part of the tone that we were trying to achieve had to do with um, addressing, I would say, what could be perceived as the cliche of modernism, having a certain banality or uh, a certain uh, genericness. And we were trying to um, capture that, that tone and amplify it. So a large part of our design was to sort of reconfigure the perception of a very neoclassical uh, building, which is the U.S. Pavilion, and use um, kind of perceptual effects like using mirrors to dematerialize the wall and extend space and extend the figure of the table and also extend the perception of, of the, the archive itself and cr kind of create this relentless effect, um, which, you know, could be interpreted as metaphoric of modernist ideology of kind of a relentless expansion. For us, I think a space of exception. It's not a it's not a typical office, but it's a it's a space. It's a space of collaboration that's engaged in architectural production in a in a new type of way. I think the best part is seeing how it's being sort of occupied. Um, we've conceived it as this kind of very um, uh, idealized thing for so long, and to see it sort of occupied and being uh, populated uh, with you know the, the individual artifacts, the tools, the the things that the, the partners are actually using. Um, is, is what this is all about, that, that experiment, that kind of proliferation. And it's almost like wanting to see it kind of grow um, much, much more beyond this kind of, kind of level and sort of see where that, that could be. I, I'm excited to hand over sort of our project to the partners to see the way that the table can be used as a generative device. Um, I think that there's a lot of potential both for sort of creating work Particular, to display in a particular way, but also to come up with new ways to make something by having, for example, such an expansive uh, surface to work on. That's something not typical, especially of offices in New York, of our own office. Um, so to see the way that a group of people can come together and use this sort of what might seem super fundamental, just a surface, a table, to really generate something new.